with more and more byod devices coming these days understanding nac is critical guys so that's why i just wanted to create a quick video today so that you can understand the operation of nac how it works how new devices are coming on board what happens when you connect a new device what is the functionality of a nac we will discuss each and everything in this video just stay tuned so first of all let us try to understand what is nac nac as the name itself suggest network access control means that who has which device has control of your network which device can authenticate to your network which device can authorize within your network because when you implement a nac solution when you implement nac solution you have to implement policies guys you have to implement policies you have to define what kind of controls do you want to have in place for example uh, do you want to have antivirus solution in place for any device to connect to the network do you want to have the latest security patches for any device to connect to the network what are the different policies that you want to have for any endpoint device to be connected to your network so that user can access your network what is the importance of having a nac solution these days because these days there are a lot of byod devices so without a nac solution if anybody connects to your environment uh, you know it is harmful to your environment guys because if there is no proper antivirus solution if there is no proper patching to the endpoint you can imagine yourself what can happen to the network okay so here what you basically do is when you implement a nac solution is you implement a baseline security baseline state you mention by defining a policy so that you allow which type of devices you will grant which devices you will block which devices you will uh, you know quarantine so these are the three uh, you know resultants of having a network access control in place okay so whenever as discussed in this diagram any new device comes on board you authenticate it you authorize it and accordingly you take these three actions now let us see how these steps actually happen one by one okay so let's say there is a new device on the network so the new device joins to the network it asks for an ip address that is the first thing that any device would do for okay so it asks for a ip address so where will it get the ip address from the dhcp server but not so quickly in case of a nac solution the switch actually passes the device information on to a radius server remote authentication dial in user service is the name of the radius server so what a switch does is instead of passing on the request to the dhcp server it basically passes on to a radius server now what happens within inside the radius server inside the radius server it gets the authentication checks in place it checks whether your device is owned by the company or is a personal device and whether the device is present in the organizational active directory or not how it checks it checks through step 3 using a directory server is nothing but a active directory okay here if you will have the device then the device will show up whether it will be in a vlan 1 or vlan 2 like you know group a group b these are different vlans so depending upon the vlan the device will show up which device it belongs to okay but let's say the device is not there not there in the active directory then what will it do it will simply drop it because user will not be assigned an ip address and could not connect to the network if it is not there as simple as that okay but if user exist if the user who is authenticating on the device if it, if it exist if if it is there inside the active directory the login info matches okay for the device as well as for the user then you get ip address in the step 5 the dhcp server assigns the ip address to the device that is there so this is a small functionality of how any nac solution would work out and again only three states majorly not to complicate it one is to allow it one is to quarantine and the other is to block okay so these are the three major states for any nac access network access control solution and
थैंक यू सो मच फॉर वॉचिंग